Hi friends, it's Ms. Mac again, and today we're going to talk about our letter friend, our letter people friends, letters G, H, and I. We're going to um, read about them, so I want you to listen for their letter sounds, and then look on the pictures to be able to identify the number or the letter. So I want you guys to say it with me, okay? I can. I can. Identify letters. Identify letters. Okay, so if you guys can remember who I said we were going to talk about, play a little game as I'm reading. Now look at this letter, letter friend. What letter is that? That is letter G. So that is Mr. G, isn't it? Now I'm going to read what he's saying here. I, Mr. G, may I offer you some of my gooey, gooey gum? Gobble, bubble, gobble, bubble. Gooey gum gets me in trouble. So there was lots of G sounds in there, wasn't it? Gooey, gooey gum. Gobble, gobble. The oil gets. There's lots of good G words in there, wasn't there? All right, now, can you tell me who this friend is? Do you remember that letter? That's right, that's Mr. H, isn't it? And what did he have? Happy hair, didn't he? Okay, Mr. H is my name. Happy hair brings me fame. My happy hair is long and green. It makes people smile whenever I'm seen. So what, did, what was he talking about? His, Happy hair. Look at his green happy hair. Mr. H. All right. Now, do we remember this guy? What letter is it that's on his sweatshirt? That's right. That is the letter I. So that's Mr. I, isn't it? Okay. I'm Mr. I, the measuring guy, and although I really try and try, my impossible inches, inches won't measure together in sunny, rainy, or cloudy weather. So inch, that's met like a measurement, like on a, on a ruler or something, isn't it? Like look, it's got little rulers on there because he measures inches. That's an I word, isn't it? Okay, so we talked about G, H, and I. So, okay, this one is, I'm gonna need your grown-ups to help us with this one. Okay, and we'd like for you to just do it on a page in your um, journals. At the top, just make a scramble like we've done before. Just make sure that G, H, and I is in there with your scrambled up letters, and then have our friends circle it to identify them out of all the other ones. And then down at the bottom, have them practice their name and go ahead and have them practice writing the G and the H and the I as well. So once you finish that, please post a picture of it and have a good rest of your day. Bye.